You don't really know much about Halloween. And welcome to another Sinister Snacks. I'm your host, Laura. I'm Joel. And we're the Newly Dids. And today we're trying a new snack, also chips. It looks like Seems key and like peel, but it's K and G. So K and G no kettle cooked hot chili lime potato chips. We found this while traversing the wilds of the freeway. And uh, we're at a gas station somewhere, I believe. Saw that and I was like, that sounds like a Laura chip. And so I snagged it. At the Come and Go gas station in oh. Des Moines, Iowa. Oh, is that when we went to go to visit Kansas City? Maybe. Might have been on the way back. I don't know. They're still good. Oh, yeah. No, it wasn't that long ago. <laughs> yeah. No. Uh, I mean, well, whenever we got them. Woo-wee! That was a scent. Scent to behold. Scent of a woman. Hoo-ah. Scent of not a woman. If the, if the woman smells like this, there's something wrong with her. Oh, go see a doctor, please. Oof. She likes spicy stuff. She likes kettle chips. That's a weird looking chip. Chippin'. Smell it. Oh, and what happened? The bag exploded. I'm sorry. <clears throat> it had a little thing for me to pull on. Trying to find one that's big enough to like not burn my brain. Uh, they're all just tiny. I, I just know. think it's going to be tangy. <clears throat> Let's find out. So, cheers, cheers before, before you chew. chew. Not just hanging. Oh, that's weird. I thought for sure she'd like these. I'm going to hazard a guess right now. Oh, it's spicy. Holy it crap. It's getting worse. That just blew up in my mouth. Huh. Oh. Oh, uh. I don't taste lime. Uh, I just taste a lot of very strong. It is hot. Cutting it at two. <coughs> that is like my eyes are watering. Yeah, that's like if you uh, you took a can of mace and just went in your mouth and then said, uh, "Trying to think what it reminds me of." Literally cleared out my nostrils. <laughs> um, yeah. What is that? What is that spice? I mean, it's chili, but is that all it is? I'm just it's a very reminiscent, like it's a familiar smell or Garlic. flavor. They are not kidding around though, kids. Uh, a lot of times when we get spicy chips, even the ones that are like mango habanero, I eat them and I think mayonnaise is spicy. Uh, but that that is legitimately actually like pretty spicy for a chip. By most of the standards anyway, of, of what we've eaten in them. I'd rather have a jalapeno flavor. Because the jalapeno at least has that earthy, gunnet, grassy smell, you know, or like taste to it. You know what I'm talking well, about? I like the flavor. Yeah, the flavor of jalapenos is pleasant. That's just come almost like hot for the sake of hot. Mm. Oh no! Plus the chips are like I don't know how to describe it. Like I, I want to say the word dirty, but it's like they're it's like it's more like the skin made in the back without the potatoes. <laughs> yeah, they're they're, they're made. <laughs> like here's the regular chip factory, and they're like. Let's just make this batch back here. Joey, go in the back and get the, uh, the, the spice for the come and go. The spice. Because <laughs> like, it doesn't say what kind of spice it is. It just says spice. Which is a little scary. The, 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 the sandwich? The gas station people. In Dune? At, at, the- at the actual like gas station. They're just in the back like and They're in frying. the world of Dune and they're getting the spice. Frying the potatoes. The spice flow and... Yeah, but then they're taking all the good part of the potato and they're sending it out to be eaten by hungry uh, customers and then they're keeping all the scraps the, the scraps, and then they're throwing them into a big pile of dirt and then they cook them up and then they spice them and then they go. I mean, I don't think it tastes like dirt, but no, but that's they're not great. It's not great. So on a scale of one to ten, what would you give it? 
Really? Um, I'm doing a three because I mean they're they're okay, not really, but yeah. I'll give it a one for consistency. But I will never eat those again. No, never. This is the end of those chips. Goodbye, chips. Yeah, I've had a good life. Adios. All right. So if they don't want to eat come and go chips. Then you can go to our website at thenewlydeads.com. Check out all of our content that is available. We have things that we release about six times a week. Um, you can also check to see any upcoming events where we will be at uh, Hawk and Our Wares because uh, we are also artists. So you can go there and look at that. There's a bunch of information about where to find us about us, uh, our history, links to all of our uh, videos and, and our podcast, etc. cetera. Uh, and I feel like there's something I'm missing, but kind of covers it. I'm, got, I'm kind of overwhelmed by the spice. It's and flowing now, freely in my mouth still. It's, it's hurting my brain. Oh, all Sorry right. Come and go. We've gone and went. Yeah. Well, thank you very much for watching. And until next time. We're going to quit yakking and get back to snacking something else.